Stumbled across a nuptial flight today of these meat ants, Eridomermex purpolis. <laughs> So I was at work today and I came across this uh, big colony of Eridomermex purpolis, or commonly known as the meat ants here in Australia. So it was a huge colony, many entrances, and as you can see, nuptial flights were starting. Now a bit of background for the uh, weather locally here. Um, it's been raining the last few days, and then today the sun was out and it was very humid and hot. So all of those things line up for nuptial flights. This is around about two o'clock in the afternoon as well. So here we can see plenty of activity going on and we can see the males there, the drones just popping out of the nest. Okay, so here we can see plenty of drones uh, coming out of the nest. Now, I did manage to get some queens as well. Uh, they are quite hard and quite timid, not really coming out very often. But I did manage to get some, so stay tuned for that. But a little bit of background on nuptial flights. So we have the males, the drones here with the wings that you can see. They're coming out of the nest. The queens will also come out of the nest. Now, you can't collect those queens. Um, they're not fertile and they have not mated at all. So there's no point collecting the queens at this stage. What you need to do is find them when they've actually mated already outside of the nest, and then you can collect them. Um, so better if they've dropped their wings, then they actually have mated, you know for sure, and then they'll be looking to start their own nest. So just something to keep in mind when you do see these nuptial flights. There's no point at all collecting queens at this stage. Now I'll let you just enjoy a bit of the footage here of this uh, nuptial flight underway and shortly we'll have a look at that queen. Now one thing you might notice is these males when they go out of the entrance here and they walk away it actually looks like they're being attacked by the workers. But they're not, they're just being dragged back to the nest. So it may not be quite time for them to take flight. Now I'm not exactly sure of the science behind what happens here during a nuptial flight. Maybe there's not enough pheromones or they're just waiting for the perfect time to fly away and to begin mating. But the workers grab them, drag them back. They're not hurting them at all. They're just making sure they're not going too far away from the nest. As you can see, there's plenty of activity going on at this nest. It was actually uh, difficult to stand this close to them without getting the workers uh, running up the legs as well. I could have uh, watched this for quite some time. It's quite entertaining. Plenty of male drones coming out of the nest all over the place. There's probably at least half, half a dozen entrances to the nest here and they're all just pouring out workers everywhere. Okay, time to have a look at that queen. There she is, look at the size of her. Big swollen abdomen, again not getting too far before she runs back inside that nest. But she was huge. She was way bigger than what I thought she would be actually. Well, I hope you enjoyed this uh, video, this footage of this nuptial flight of the Eridomermex purpolis, uh, the meat ant, commonly known as. Um, if you love the video, please give it a like, uh, thumbs up, and uh, comment down below as well. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I'd appreciate a subscribe, and I've got many more videos to come. All right, thanks very much, and happy ant keeping.